How's it going everyone? Today we're going to be showing you how to get and merge all helmets including combat helmets, bulletproof helmets and also riot helmets in GTA Online. I'll also be providing the chart to merge these helmets as you can see on the screen right here as well as in the link in the description area. So let's get straight into the video. Alright, firstly I'm going to buy all the donor helmets as well as the target helmets just to show you guys how it works in this video. Alright, once you've got all your helmets, you just want to go outside and call your personal vehicle. It has to be a car, not a bike. You can also use the street vehicle to do this. Alright, for the merge, firstly you need to equip your target helmet. Open up your interaction menu, go to styles, go to accessories and equip the helmet. In this case, we're going to use the brown quad lens. Then you want to back out under styles. You want to equip your donor helmet as your bike helmet. As you can see from the chart, we want to get the purple one, so we have to use the pink open face helmet as the donor helmet. Also, you need to ensure that the helmet visor is up. Then you have to register as a CEO. Close the interaction menu. Enter your vehicle and quickly open the interaction menu, go to style and just hover on the parachute. Once your character is inside the car, back out, go to your CEO menu, go to management, go to style, and then press right once and left once for the VIP style. You can now get out of the car, back out to style, and you want to put the helmet visor down. You have now successfully merged your helmet into the purple colored one. All you have to do now is go inside the clothing store and save the outfit. Alright, let's recap another time. Now let's do it for the right helmet and try to get the pink one. You guys just have to do the same thing. Open up your interaction menu, go to style, accessories, and equip the LSPD riot. Then you want to back out, choose your donor helmet. In this case, we're going to use the digital helmet as your bike helmet. Remember to set the visor helmet up. Once you've done that, we're going to do the same thing. Close the interaction menu, enter your vehicle, open up your interaction menu again, go to style and hover on the parachute. Once your character is inside the car, you want to back out, go to CEO menu, and you want to change your CEO outfit once to the right and then once to the left. Get out of the vehicle and then you just have to put the helmet visor down and you successfully merge another helmet. For other helmets variation and colors, you can refer to the chart right here as well as the link in the description area. Alright, now let's talk about the bulletproof helmets. For PC and Xbox, Players, you can find the link in the description area to the social club page where you just have to bookmark the job and then restart your game. For PS4 and PS5 players, I haven't gotten the link to the social club yet. So if you guys know any of the links, feel free to put it in the comment section. So I'll update it in the blog post. This way we can help other players, especially on the PS4 and PS5 as well. So let's get straight into it. Firstly, you want to open up the pause menu, go to jobs, go to bookmark jobs and go to last team standings. And you want to create a job that is called safe orange slash purple joggers. And after that, you just have to invite someone in random, like I did completely solo. Or if you have a friend, it'll make things much easier. You can also join the Discord link in the description area where people are helping each other out there. Once you enter the job, your character will automatically equip the bulletproof helmet as well as the joggers. For the host, you'll get the orange one. If you join the game, you get the purple one. So you guys can do this back and forth. Alright, the next step is pretty simple. You just have to open up your interaction menu. Go to inventory and go to body armor and you want to set your show armor to any of the armor. And then close your interaction menu and open up your phone and simply leave the job. Once you're out of the job, you'll be wearing the same outfit. You just have to go to the nearest clothing store and save the outfit. So that's it for today's video, hope you find it useful. If you did, be sure to hit that like and also subscribe to the channel for more future GTA videos. This is Joe and I'll see you next time.